Hello, I'm uh, Javad from Keller Williams. Uh, so I just wanted to share a few things. I have been researching a lot on uh, first time home buyers in Rhode Island. Uh, I'm licensed in Rhode Island. So it seems that uh, there are a lot of uh, fear mongers. I call them the doomsday sayers. And what basically they do is that they um, they create fear. They create a lot of fear uh, into, I, I don't know what's the motive behind this. So they say that the market is going to crash, the market is going to crash, the market is going to crash. And they're saying this uh, like with such conviction that that will, that will even confuse a very uh, experienced realtor. So I'm basically new. Uh, it's my second year uh, being a realtor. So, so what I have, uh, so what I have concluded is that there is like, like that there's a specific guy. He has a few videos, and each month he creates a new video. And his video is titled uh, that the real uh, the real estate market is going to crash in June, this June. Then when the June, June passes, he creates another one stating that the real estate market is going to crash this August. Then when August passes, now he's created another one uh, that real estate is going to crash this September. And this is almost the end of September. And uh, I don't know for how long he will go. Uh, there are some, uh, so there are a few things that I wanted to, that I wanted to, uh, that I wanted to share with you. So, uh, bear with me uh, because uh, I don't have enough time I'm doing uh, I'm also selling cars so uh, because you know real estate is slow so you need to you need to find uh, alternate source of income if you're a real estate agent so the problem is that uh, most people are like they want to buy a house they just want to buy a house they are, and they're sick and tired of all this confusing uh, information out on the internet. So what I did was that I went through almost every single video in the Rhode Island and there are not a lot of uh, videos for Rhode Island. Uh, that's another, uh, like it's a shame because Rhode Island is a beautiful state and it is small and I, I do know that it gets, uh, people laugh at Rhode Island that it's small. Uh, but uh, it is what it is so so the like the problem uh, is that if you want to buy a house and you're waiting for the market to crash and then buy it cheap you are you are in for a ride because uh, the market is not going to crash and there are a few reasons because uh, like into the it's the market is not as it was in 2008 uh, where everyone would receive uh, like would, would everyone would get approved for a loan even even by having a pulse even if they were in coma they used to get approved so the market is not the same and uh, so so it's not like it's not going to crash anyway soon so if you are serious in buying a house you should already start searching uh, I can uh, tell you about Rhode Island Rhode Island is a uh, a beautiful state and it is in a very strategic location so I've seen that people have left people are leaving New York uh, they have left New, uh, almost 60,000 people have left New York in 2023 it may increase uh, b uh, by the end of uh, December we can get the like the final statistics for that numbers don't lie and uh, they are the same wherever you go whichever country you go numbers are numbers you cannot argue with the numbers and even as like, like people are leaving in California they're leaving and uh, so the, the top state that I found and I was very shocked was that people are going into Kansas I don't know uh, like I don't know what the reason might be uh, but they are moving to Kansas and it was on the top so this is what I remember from it in this information overload uh, time that we are living in I hope my uh, you can listen to me because I am driving and I do not have a mic so I hope the, the audio is not bad because it's the only thing I'm worried about so I'll speak loudly so if you want to buy a house start searching from now on and the first thing that you like the, anyone will tell you is that to get approved get approved for a loan 
if you do not li uh, like if you do not get approved then then like no one will trust you no one will, no one will take you seriously so get approved and uh, then start to search uh, Rhode Island is a small state there are places uh, which are expensive and they and like and beautiful so it's it's up to you if you are in like if you are a retired couple this is the best place for you because it's serene it's uh, like like it's peaceful uh, there are a lot of misconceptions about uh, Rhode Island which is also a shame uh, so I'm like this is my first video making uh, in a car so there might be a bit uh, discrepancies my apologies for that so if you are serious uh, in buying a house just you know just go for it don't wait for the markets to crash because it is uh, it's, it, it is in, at seven percent at this time and it may go towards eight or even nine so it's not going down and you can always refinance so that shouldn't be a problem and that shouldn't be a hindrance for you to st like not to buy a house even if you are here stationed for a few years i would still recommend buying a house it's much better than these uh, uh, the rents as they are um, as they get as they're getting increasing is that increasing a lot and it's not easy uh, with these rents too so a normal a, a normal apartment would be twelve hundred dollars so if, if you can get um, a mortgage for uh, like for that price it's a win-win situation uh, and uh, Rhode Island is still much better yes the prices and everything has increased three three times here and so has it in every other place if you're uh, so it's a pew and uh, it's uh, as you know that it, it is the east coast so it is cold it's not that cold it's not crazy cold it's uh, like normal cold uh, la last year was fantastic 2022 had the uh, least amount of snowfall uh, they are, are trying to uh, so like it was really nice even the summer here was like the summer here uh, the summer here this uh, this year was not too harsh it was okay last like in 2021 it was severe uh, no 2021 yeah 2022 in 2022 the uh, the summer was really uh, like hot and the winter was harsh too so so if you are looking to buy a house just go for it uh, don't uh, pay heed to these uh, fear mongers i call them the doomsday sayers they will come up with stuff there and and, and now you know and now when it's like now it's the end of uh, like almost 2023 now now they're making new videos and the new videos and articles are that the, it's going to crash in 2024 and then 2025 and 26 27 do you know time is money time is the currency so you shouldn't be wasting time and uh, just go for it and make your mind and make a decision do as much research as you possibly can and at the end of it just go for it and stick to your decision because uh, Wasting time will get you nowhere, and and by and after a few years, after a few years, as as Bill Gates say that people underestimate uh, the uh, you know people underestimate the power of decades. So after a few years, you would be like, why didn't I buy a house? You would have been like, you would have almost a hundred thousand dollars in equity by that time. So just go for it. Uh, don't be scared, and uh, like. It's not the situation is not getting better. Uh, uh, like if you want three or four percent uh, mortgage rates, like uh, interest rates, it is not going to happen. So let's be realistic here. Like like let's don't let, let's not be uh, unrealistic and uh, let's stick to what's like you know to. And if you want to go to uh, Florida or uh, if you're good with. Uh, the, like hot weather which most of the people are uh, you can go there or uh, Texas if you are okay with that then go there but if you like the weather you know it's raining right now so it's not it, it doesn't rain like crazy it's not England but it's New England so the similarities are uh, uncanny so just just go for it uh, see your budget see, uh, your uh, your mortgage rate shouldn't ex exceed more than 30% of your income. If you are a couple, 
then uh, you know add your add it together if you are earning uh, in like if your if your income is not uh, consistent if you like if you get earned uh, by if you get earned by commissions then they will take a look at the two years your two years uh, of commission and then they will take a mean and uh, so just go for it uh, I'm right now I'm in Lincoln it's a beautiful city uh, the rates have increased uh, like the rates have increased but it's nice the houses are uh, well apart which I personally like I want my house to ha have enough space but it's not close to any other house which it should be so as far as Providence I live in Providence and the houses in Providence are not uh, like you there they might like you can find beautiful houses but uh, the houses can be you know close so they're like just come here if you haven't made your mind if you're looking in New England you can go up you can go to Maine you can go to Connecticut uh, New Hampshire we do, we, you, you do not need to pay any taxes if you want there that's up to you I can only tell you about Rhode Island uh, so buying a house is uh, is an investment that you will never regret and just don't go too overboard just you know if if you if your financial if your financial situation is not good then just go for a normal house your first house doesn't need to be perfect you can wait save money and then buy for go for another one so just uh, talk to your local lenders and then talk to the bank you're working with try to have two or three uh, lenders uh, talk to them see what they come up with and uh, you know buy a house because uh, there's a saying in Pashto that uh, is this Pradikat Danimish Pivi which means that uh, something that's not yours will be taken from you in the most dire of consequence like situations like you might need your house the house the most you might have a death in your family or, or anything and it might be taken from you so you can never trust it you might your kids might have grown in a rent house and they might love it and then the, you will you know the, 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 like he might give you a, a, a notice which has happened to us all our life this is this is the reason I came into real estate uh, so like this has happened to us and uh, you know I even I'm looking for a house for like for my own I like uh, I like Lincoln uh, North Smithfield but you can go for any other place you want so just think about think about it I'm going to the video is getting longer I don't like uh, long videos so just think about it and uh, you know uh, deal with anyone you want make sure he is in the industry for a long time and uh, enjoy so have a good day. See you soon.